Today is the day the assembly starts on the 606. My goal for the day is the short block. So i got some things going on this afternoon, but if I could at least get uh, that far, I would be happy. Got everything I need out here and in a couple boxes in the garage. Um, if I can get farther, that would be great. But uh, like I said, at least the short block is the goal. So we'll check in in a few moments. Okay, so I started uh, with the piston ring, so I got all the rings on, and if my drill battery is all uh, charged, then it'll be time to hone. So next step will be honing, and then we're going to set the crank in place. Okay, so I got the uh, cylinders all honed up here. Okay, so before I put the crankshaft in, I wanted to point out, uh, true to form, Mercedes has numbered all the caps. And one of the, a couple other things to note, the, uh, the first cap has different uh, bolts on it, and uh, the fifth cap, if we notice, it has the thrust washer in there. So I'll need to uh, put those back into place, and then once I get the, uh, the crank installed, we'll go ahead and uh, take a look at it. All right, so crank's kind of in. I got uh, the fifth cap on, and I started with the fifth cap uh, because of the thrust washers. Uh, everything is lubed up. I've got uh, Permatex Ultra Slick I'm using. And, uh, it's, of course, it's not tight, right? It's not uh, torqued down yet. But I wanted to start there to make sure I got these uh, in place. So we'll go ahead and, and I will uh, continue on putting the caps. And we'll check back in in a moment. Okay, so the crank is in. Time to put in the pistons. Again, I've already done the rings. Uh, but I wanted to show the arrow. I just put out a video, pistons and ring, or rods and rings or something like that. And uh, we see here there is an arrow pointing to the front of the engine. So if I point it so the front of the engine would be facing me, again, the, uh, the locks on the rod, on the rod side, would be on the right. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, put the ring compressor on this and slap the pistons in, and then we'll check it out. So the crank and the rods are in. They're all torqued down. Now the, uh, everything is in newton meters. So the rods are cranked down to 40 newton meters of force and then you got to follow up with a second torquing of 90 degrees and the caps are 55 newton meters and same thing you've got to uh, follow that up with a second torquing of 90 degrees but uh, the short block is almost complete I would have liked to have uh, got the pump on and the chain for the pump some other things but this is uh, kind of my stopping point for the day so thanks for watching, and uh, next time hopefully I get to the head portion of the build.